What is going on guys? It is your boy Boss Plays coming back at you with another video. Now today's video is a Fortnite video. Now as we all know, it's to do with mobile. But before we get into the video, make sure to drop a like, make sure to subscribe to this channel, turn on the bell post notifications so you're aware when this video when the next video is out. We all know the lawsuit that's going on with Fortnite and Apple, should I say? Now if you don't know what's going on, Epic put a lawsuit against Apple because they deleted their game off the App Store. Now the reason was because they dropped a lower price for V-Bucks on the game where it, you had a set price for Apple and you had a set price for Epic and Epic's was lower than Apple's so people were choosing the cheaper option and that was going towards Apple, not towards Epic should I say. Now obviously Apple were pissed off and they've deleted the game off the App Store and we've actually got recent news that MacBooks will not be able to download Fortnite anymore. So if you have a MacBook and you're playing Fortnite on the MacBook, you will not be able to play this game any longer. Now, it's a matter of probably weeks, I would say, where they're going to delete this, the, the game off the App Store on, on MacBooks. Android users, they did delete the game, but luckily enough, you can still potentially download it, possibly download it and possibly play it. Possibly not Season 4 because they've done the same thing with Androids as well, choosing a cheap option on VBooks. Now, Fortnite have done this to themselves. I'm going to be totally honest with you guys. They've probably done it to themselves a lot worse than what they should have. They were cheeky. They shouldn't have done this. It's created all this fiasco. Apple are saying that there's a 70% decline in interest in Fortnite between October 2019 and June 2020. This is the recent file that they put against Epic. This just shows what Apple are trying to say. They're trying to say that Fortnite are putting in this lawsuit and doing all of this just to create a bit more interest in Fortnite. But they're using Google Trends. People are saying that it's a bit of a false lie, uh, a false narrative. But this is cheeky from, from Fortnite, from Apple, I'll be honest with you guys. And it's cheeky from Fortnite for them doing this. Rush are also too involved. They're saying that Fortnite should have their own app. And if this uh, legislation passes through, Fortnite Mobile should be back. But September 28th is the date that we'll find out what is going on, whether or not uh, Apple will re-download, reinstall the game back into App Store or if they permanently delete Fortnite off the App Store and if Epic lose their battle against Apple. Now, it's a crazy situation, guys. I want to know in the comment section below what, what do you think of this situation. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, let me know in the comment section below and I can show you beautiful faces later. Peace.